So congratulations on being here. Thank you. Must feel very good. I'm asking everybody tonight, what was the most surprising moment on your journey from inception when you first got involved to being here on the, uh, on the carpet? Um, it's very incremental. So first you make a film and just being able to complete it, you know, you're thinking, wow, it's a fucking, it's a miracle essentially. And then you start submitting it to festivals and you start getting rejections and you start getting uh, acceptance to smaller festivals and then you make another film and really it's, it's been very incremental in the last three years since I just started making films three years ago. Um, and yeah, you slowly you know, go up the ladder of the festivals and awards and uh, it's you know, super exciting to be here tonight, of course. And what do you hope people take away from the films that you've got in the festival and the award circuits at the moment? Yeah, so actually we had a film that, uh, two films that were long listed for the BIFA. Uh, one was long listed and the other one is nominated, Anna, and both of them are uh, actually they make uh, part of a series Ladies of films. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the British Independent Film Awards. The doors to the main room where dinner will be served are now open, just at the end of the red carpet. So please, make your way through to dinner now. All right, let's yeah. head back up. So, yeah. just tell us about the films and uh, how you got from inception to here. So, um, I've been, before I was a filmmaker, I was traveling for five years uh, around the world because I work uh, online. So then I've just encountered all these different stories in different places and different countries. And when I became a filmmaker, I just went back to these places and I made films from basically the most interesting things that I've encountered. So the, the, my previous film was shot in Nepal, and this one was shot in Ukraine, and I'm planning to go to uh, Brazil in a couple of uh, months to shoot the third part of this omnibus uh, or anthology that I'm working on. And each story tells a story uh, basically of people who are underprivileged uh, in all these different countries, so there is a certain theme that goes through them. And uh, yeah, and every story is about has a different message and a different story behind it. So it's been very exciting to work on it. Excellent night for you so far. We spoke on the red carpet. Yes, and blue I carpet. It was blue, blue. blue carpet. I apologize. Mm, yeah, was it blue? I mean, it's <laughs> really kind of gray <laughs> on the gray carpet. Um, this is a rain. Oh, I see, I see. Nice, I get it. The rain batters. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know why carpets are red, by the way? No. Because, because in Ephesus, it? it started in Ephesus when they would have dignitary, they would spill wine so on right. the, yeah, where the boats would come. So as, they a, as a show. For a great carpet, isn't it? They, um, white wine? Yeah. Mm. No. Oh, maybe. <laughs> That's very good. <laughs> okay, okay. So, so what does this win uh, mean for you guys? I guess we will find out soon. We, yeah, we just, uh, I guess, recognition for all the hard work that we've been yeah. doing in the last three years. And we're super grateful for it. It was a really, a truly independent short yeah. film that we kind of like bootstrapped from, you know, from the ground up. And we just went to Ukraine just with a script. The entire crew and um, cast, everybody were Ukrainian. I think, I think in a lot of ways, what's important um, for this award for us anyway is that it's a real recognition from an independent point of view yeah. because you know there's very little support in a lot of ways from public funding a lot of time and you know we really really like try to think about like something which meant a lot to us and was unapologetic as a film and you know I think what Deckel did as a director writer was absolutely exceptional and you know we really really you know because this film premiered at Cannes in the main competition, went to Toronto, went to AFI and this for us is like a real recognition for us that there is still a lot of love and respect for indie films, even on a short level. That's basically how I see it. Yes. Excellent answer. Congratulations to both of you. Thank you. Have an excellent Thank night. You. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!